And we're here. I only grabbed the wrong coffee cup. You did. It's all good though. I got my coffee cup. I really, really like this creamer. The cinnamon. The, nasty one? the cinnamon honey vanilla. How could it be possibly nasty? I don't it's, know what you. Can... It smells like perfume. When I tried it, it smelled like I was drinking a perfume bottle. It's honey cinnamon vanilla. It smells like something I would wear. I mean, I guess I'm drinking something you would wear then. I don't know. <laughs> but it's really good. It's almost it almost reminds me of drinking like a like a a coffee cake, like a cinnamon coffee cake. Yeah. Where are you going? <laughs> I'm still here. Oh. Um I forget to plug it. And like and like a little bit of like that um, vanilla tea that I like. Oh, the vanilla chai tea? Yeah, the chai tea. It's almost got that little flavor to it, which is good. But I don't know how long that creamer is going to be out because it's it was in a bunker at the store. And I was nasty. like, And I was like, oh, I haven't seen this before. <laughs> so I picked it up. I was like, okay. I didn't see much of it um, recently, though. But I like that other one. I'm good with just the sweet cream. It's fine, but. I like the we got the cookie one too. Yeah, we got to come up with crazy concoctions for coffee and stuff just to practice coffee making. Um, you make the bag ugly. What? You make the bag ugly. You're showing its inside. Oh yeah, the bag. The bag is amazing. This is this is how you make a bag. Okay, this is not um, that horrible clingy stuff that. Um, what's that game? Quacks of Quenlinburg has issues with bags. that. That I don't know, but I almost made you play that the other night when we were play games because it was at the. There the are bar. some bags where you stick your hand in there, and the bag literally grabs on and does not let go. It's just like, no, I want your hand in the bag. And that's what Quacks did to me when we played it because every time I reached into the bag, pulled you know, out. It's an easy replacement, right? I know, but the, the fact is, you, you, you're not paying for the you, bag. You're paying no, for but the game. I mean, they play test these things, right? You gotta go. Oh, some of these guys are having trouble with this bag here. You know, we no, should probably we fix that. Ever. I don't but know. when we played it at the game store, I remember all the like little tokens flying out as I was pulling my tokens out, and I just kept getting more angrier and angrier. I was like, I don't care if I lose or win or what. But that was my story. But yeah, this like quacks bag. Yeah, I don't like quacks bags. But this bag here is phenomenal. It's it's how a bag should be made. It's not cheap. It's it's got it's some type of fabric that does not cling to your hand when you reach in, and it just feels good. It really does. It looks like what boxers are made out of. Yes, yeah, I should get a flaming set of boxers to match this. Every time you play. <laughs> Fire in the copyright. Oh wait, we're streaming, so let's start. <laughs> let's start streaming. No. Um, fire in the library. Um, I we, I saw this while we were at um, Origins, and I was at the booth helping out, and I saw this, and I was like, oh, this game looks like it's a book. As you can see, here's the game, and look at that. It looks exactly like a book. No, it's like that one behind us that like, we haven't played. Oh, I was like, man, that's, that is so neat. What kind of game is this? And then, you know. Where did that game go? What? I was like, oh, it's like the one behind us that we haven't played yet. I'm like, wait, I moved it. Where the hell did it go? I don't know where it went. But Justin was showing this off at the uh, Weird Giraffe Games booth. And I was just like, oh, man, I think you would like it. It's a push your luck game. You're trying to save your library books. Um, Where's the game? Oh, it's it's up there somewhere. It's up there somewhere. All right, so let's go ahead and just get started with the game here. Because um, I gotta find a game after <laughs> stream. Yeah. So here is our library. Okay, these four stacks of cards. Um, is our library and when you put them together they actually form a sort of a library yeah i just don't want to put them close together i just want them to yeah. on stream yeah but it looks really cool when you do put them together it looks like a fantastic this is what it looks like 
when you put them together. Looks really freaking cool. Um, huh? I don't know. I messed up everything. There. <laughs> yeah. So we're trying to save this library right now. It's perfectly fine, but something has happened. Um, You're gonna catch things on fire. Something has happened. Uh, a fire is starting to break out, and we cannot control it. And we have to save as much knowledge as possible. So this is our library. The cards are set up um, the same way, no matter how many players you have. Um, the game is gonna take. Um, the 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 game time is variable because it depends on how fast you burn the library down. Really. Yeah. So you're you're trying to push your luck, trying to save the library. And plus, my mom is a retired librarian who loves playing games, so I decided to unmark and watch. I was looking around for games she'd like. Oh, this one would probably. High uh, panic and high phantom. Yeah, this one would probably pique her interest. If she likes pressure luck, catching yeah. books on fire. Um. Okay, where was I? Okay, library on fire. We have to save the books. Yep. And we're going to do that by pulling uh, cubes out of the bag. Okay? The cubes are all going to be different colors. There's going to be some uh, purple, yellow, white, and black cubes, I believe. Okay. And they all correspond to these different stacks of books here. Um, and they all have their own genre. I can't remember what they are. They're on the back of the card. I think the yellow is the war, war books. Um... I think the black is it's literally politics. in the books. <laughs> anyway, it, this it really doesn't matter. It does. No. No. We just have to save them all. Purple is fables. White is geography. History is black. And okay. war is yellow. All right. So we're saving books in a library that's on fire. And we're going to be making mistakes along the way. Nope. Yes. You are. <laughs> I totally am. I'm really bad at, you know, push your luck things and... And that's what we're doing. Um, we've got some tools that we can use during the game. And they're all going to be used during different phases of the game, too. And that's denoted by the little icon on the top corner there. So this one is to be played during the... Um, fire spreading phase. Fire spreading phase. Which will happen. That one is um, during the saving books phase. Yes, this one is during the saving books phase. And then um, there's a couple of other ones. Yeah. There's some after scoring stuff, and then there's some. Um, choosing turn order. Yeah, choosing turn order stuff. So these are going to be our turn order cards, okay? And you see, they're kind of they're pretty different. Some are better than others. The more riskier cards have more bravery points on them. The less riskier ones have more tool icons on them and less points. Um, to start off, we're just going to pick them up at random. Yep. So do you want the first set, or do you want to pick your yours? or just Does it matter? Do it. Does it matter? Yeah. Okay. So you can get one, and the other one is just going to go here. For now. For now. Because we're going to use it. Yes. Uh, we're all going to start off with two tools um, that we can use during the game. I'm the orange maple. I'm going to start here. Where's yours? Yellow? Yep. I already flipped my card. You already flipped your card? Yeah. Oh, I did not flip mine yet. Um, okay, so how do we play? So the game is played in, start. in phases. Okay, yeah, might as well just start. Um, these are the fire cubes, okay? These are the bad cubes. We don't want these cubes to come out of the bag, but they are. Um, oh, well, I didn't even I see like, mine read yet. These cards. Like I. Oh hey, <laughs> I got this one. Cool. Oh no. <laughs> That's awesome. Well, we know what this one is now. Yeah. All right, so I've got a a map. Which score your bravery points from this round again? Draw a card from the tool deck. That's cool. What do you? The map. map. Okay. And then the torch, draw three tokens from the library bag, add at least one to your turn order card, leaving any fire tokens on the torch till the end of your turn. 
And saves fire. <clears throat> yeah, it gets rid of it gets fire. rid of fire. That's cool. That's a pretty good card you gave me there. Thank you. Nope. <laughs> All right, so we're just gonna go ahead and play and uh, explain as we go. Yep. I'm gonna go first. So yes, you are going first because you are second. So we're gonna give the bag a little shiggity shake. Um. There you go. All so right, so since it's our first turn, the choosing turn order cards cannot be played. Yeah, so choosing turn order cards cannot be played at the very first turn because it's all at random. Yeah. Um, after this, the person that's lowest on the scoreboard is going to be able to choose what card they would like first. Um, if there's a tie, I believe um, tie, ties are broken on who got to the... Um, the highest score first, right? I'm not sure about that. Yeah, I think I, I think that's what the tiebreaker is. Um, so you're going to be pulling tokens out of the bag. Okay, one at a time. Yep. Don't pull a whole bunch. Boom. What'd you get? Black. All right, so. History. So that's good. That's a history book you've got. Now you have a choice here. Do you want to keep going? Push yep. your luck? Or do you want to score right now? Oh, there you go. Okay, so the one thing about these high-risk spots here, it only takes one fire token to set the uh, books you are saving ablaze. Yep. So that is the risky part to this. Now, you can continue to try to save books and score some points. Or... I, I did have one question. Which books are worth the most points? Um, that's so that's denoted the by the numbers next to the books themselves. So right now the purple uh, fables are worth four points. Uh, the history is worth three. Uh, I don't remember what they are. I know the war ones are worth two. Um, this is going to change, though, okay. as the library burns. Uh, I'm going to run away. Now here's... Oh, oh, oh the bedroom purple wow okay i'm stopping now okay so you're you're stopping all right so you're gonna score now and let's go through scoring real quick um if you have any cards you want to play for scoring i'm gonna play one but i have to do it after scoring after scoring yeah all right, so at any point before you trigger fire spreading the active player can score points for every book they've saved um, so you're going to score for knowledge points and bravery points. Okay. So let's do the knowledge first. So you scored three points for this book. Three, four. One point for this book yeah. because of that. And then four for that one. Four for that one. Eight points. Eight points four. plus two because you made it to the two on the bravery check there. That's so... Eight. Ten points for you. You're you're way over here now. No, I'm gonna play a card. I'm playing collector's edition. Well, well, well. So place a book token that each saved on the collector's edition during each scoring knowledge step. All books of that color are worth two additional points, including during this turn. So I technically get because I'm gonna choose the purple. Okay. So what does it do? So each during each scoring knowledge step, all books of that color are worth two additional points, including this time. So I get two additional points because I'm saving that one. Oh, so that's, does that stay f yeah. throughout the whole game? Yeah. Does it really? Yep. Wow. Hey, Dutch. Hey, Dutch Yoda. Dutch says the books, the books, the books are on fire. Oh, no. Yep. Um... That is a really awesome card. So the back of the book has some of these tools. Um, yeah. A little brief description on how they're used and what they're about. It's, it's self-explanatory. I get to keep it. And that cube isn't going to go back in the bag. Uh, so I'm wondering if it, if it goes for me too, though. Why? It's not your card. Oh, yeah. Okay. No, you're right. 
All right, cool. That you've saved. All right, that's that is a good. So give that me some is more a points. really good card. <laughs> okay, I know. I am not gonna make it in this game. Okay. Um, and then I put these back into the bag, right? Yes. And then I get two tool cards. Um, I don't know. I don't think yes. so. Why not? I saved um, six on that spot. I don't. I think you you just scored for the last thing that you've put down on the track. Really? Okay. Um. Yeah, so the active player scores knowledge points equal to the current value of each book they've saved. Yep. Um, bravery points equal to the number below the token farthest to the right on their turn order card. This is a tool icon. Take a tool from the tool market or draw the top card of the tool deck. So I don't think you get it all. I think it's just wherever you left off. Well, that kind of sucks. I mean, I thought I would get tool cards too because I just used one. Get a whole bunch. You can get a you can get a whole bunch of tool right, cards. Your turn. Too. Now I put this back in the middle, right? Yeah, you could. Yeah. Okay. Sadly, it's not important. Okay, so it is my turn. Um, there's one less purple book in the bag. So let's see what happens. I want to save it. I know. You don't want to reach out. It's huh? on my Netflix. Oh, Netflix? Yeah. Um, I'm watching an anime on, well, you saw me watching. Um, it's called Something Vinland. Mm -hmm. It's about, um, it's weird watching an anime about Vikings or about the Norse, and they all look Japanese. It's yeah, just that's, really weird. That's strange. Hey, I'm doing pretty good. You now, have three safe spaces. Yeah. So for these blank spots, they're not high risk, right? Yeah. If I get two fire um, cubes in those spaces, then I will start a fire. Yeah. It only takes one on the flame spot here to start a fire. Um, I believe I'm going to keep going. So this, what can I use my choice? Draw three tokens from the library bag. Add at least one to your turn order card, leaving any fire tokens on the torch. I think I'm going to use that right now. Can't you use it at any point though? You don't have to choose to do it right now. If you start drawing fire, then you can. Um, I mean, yeah, I guess. I guess I'll wait. But I'm going to keep going because I need to catch up on their score here. Oh, so this is like watching the last Airbender movie. Ha! Yellow. That's I so like good. I you're doing good. <laughs> Why? You're not good at push your luck. I know, but... Is there but... a mummy cube in this game? You know what the cool thing is? It's just it's this bag. It's just... No, it's not this bag. We're not going this on bag bag is awesome. about this bag. Check that out. Wow. All right. I'm going to use my card. I'm going to use my torch. Why are your cards visible? Because just to be hidden. Hey, it's all right. Not you're not paying attention to my cards. No. All right. So draw three tokens from the library bag. Add at least one to your uh, turn order card, leaving any fire tokens on the torch until the end of your turn. All right. I've got three in my hand. Check that out. So that's that. I uh, put at least one on my card. Yep. Um, fire is on the torch. I'm going to go ahead and put that one there. I think this one goes back in the bag. Um, and at least one to your turn order, leaving any fire tokens on the torch. Yeah. Uh, I'm going to stop here. Okay. I am definitely going to stop here. All right. You get two, four, six, seven, eight, nine points. All right, nine, seven. nine points just in books, right? Yep. Two, four, six, plus the three is nine. Um, plus two bravery points, that's eleven points. Yeah, you're in front of me. No, I'm behind you. You got what? twelve. That's twelve. Yeah. Oh. Um. 
All right, cool. All right, all those go back in the bag. Yeah, it Let's all goes back in the bag. Tires. This card is discarded because it's been used. Uh, where can I? That's a discard pile. This one is? Mm -hmm. Yeah, let's not. You want to turn it sideways? It's good there. All this goes back in. That is the end of the round. At the end of the round, the section of the library with the lowest burn index burns. So the burn index is the small little circle with the number in it. And the lowest number is going to burn first. So highly flammable. Oh, no. There's a card with a flame on it. Well, I mean, I didn't want to burn it. I didn't want to burn it. Yeah. So as you can see, the, um, the cards are changing the way they look. Yeah. So there's more fire on it. It's so cool. Um, so this to this icon right here, this flame, put a flame on means it. we have to add a fire token to the bag, yep. which is what we're going to do right now. So there's one more in there. So there's eight. All right. So how does this turn order go now? All right. So the person um, in last place is going to choose first. Oh, that sucks. Yes. I believe that is how it works. Let me just make and sure. The of library to burn. Yep. Yeah, we did that. Um, next round begins with players returning to step one, which is the uh, turn order. Player with the lowest score on the scoring track takes their choice of turn order card. That's okay. me. Um, I Thanks. did. I did really good with this one, but I'm gonna take this one because I need some extra points okay. I'm gonna uh, take second now I get to choose. yes Shit, I'm talking about food already I know. Right? this chat is always about food I see feta and vinaigrette I am already liking what I'm reading I know I like feta that sounds really good feta is one of my favorite tomato cheeses tomato dill vinaigrette add feta ah oh, that's so good feta pizza is by far the best pizza ever uh, maybe feta on a sicilian i don't know no that one that your mom <laughs> makes is really good yeah so you chose third so i yep. go first i've got one card i could score uh braver points from this round again so hopefully i can make it that far but we'll see. So I'm going to go says, first. I'm having some leftover Cuban soy butter chicken with potatoes for lunch. Like, uh, I already made dinner because I'm trying to fast more than I've been doing. And I'm already, like, hungry again. <laughs> I ate it. All right. So these tools up here, there's certain times where you can get more tools. Um, if you... Trigger the fire spreading. Yeah. Then um, you'll burn all the books and you'll get a tool. Mm -hmm. Or you get a tool by just filling up the space and stopping. Yeah. Basically. All right, let's go. Let's see what happens. Oops, fire. Ha. Hmm. Um, I'm gonna keep going. I'm gonna draw a mistress face on one of these cubes. <laughs> oh yes. Um, okay, so this is where it gets really bad. Um, I'm gonna breathe catch them on fire. Yeah. There are now eight fire cubes. There the are bag. eight, and I don't feel like that is. I feel like I should stop now because I'm a little worried. So I am gonna stop here. I'm not going to push my luck. Okay. So I'm going to go straight to scoring. So I'm going to score points. three points for the uh, history book and four points for the fables. So seven. Seven plus 11 is 18. And I will get a tool. Now I can take one of the tools for that are showing or pull one from the top of the deck if I want to. Um, what does the cloak do? Choose one of your books to save and score for its knowledge points. 
um, listed below your last token. All of your other books are burned. Ooh. Gloves. All spaces on your turn order card are safe spaces. Do not take a tool at the end of your turn unless you cause fire spreading. Was I supposed to take a, a card at the end of my turn then? I don't think so. You just scored, right? Yeah. Hold on. Let's see. I don't remember that rule. I don't remember being able to... Um... No, you only pick up a tool if you stop on a okay. tool spot well the way that card reads was different then um do not take a tool at the end of your turn unless you cause fire spreading i guess that means if oh if you stop there you stop there to. okay yeah i don't i'm not too sure about that one all right what's the bucket the bucket um place a drawn fire token on this card until the end of your turn this does not trigger fire spreading you may continue saving books i'm gonna try to use that one okay. i'm gonna take the bucket There's what's the next lock one box a lock box Choose one book that you've saved place it on the lock box score it again at the end of the game what all right so the more these book books burn the higher the value they're going to be mm -hmm. so the end of the game is triggered when one of these um piles here or one of these sections of the library are completely burned yep so that's already one that's why i saved the purple because i know the purple is going to be worth yeah. a lot that's already one card gone so all right so i've already scored i've already taken my tool and i will end my turn and you shall go. Phantom says it was an instant, instant pot recipe I discovered. Chicken thighs, potatoes, soy sauce, whole stick of butter, salt, pepper, cumin, garlic. Oh, that sounds really good. Right, here we go. I could really go for. Um, you remember when we used to have that Jamaican restaurant back in our old yeah. town? Um, they had some really awesome like jerk chicken and jerk goat was it uh oh <gasps> no it's fine everything's good it's fire okay so if you get a second one you you start a fire mm -hmm. okay i'm just yes. just putting that that out there all right so i'm i finished my turn Guys, if you want to check this game out, uh, Moobot's not going to do it, so I'll go ahead and do it myself. Uh, it is, I believe, $25 um, at this link. You can check that out. It's got, there's a video on there. What the hey? <laughs> Did you just look in the bag and pull yeah, those out? I've just been pulling cubes. <laughs> the heck? Oh, it's watching me. Oh, man. I'm done. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, no kidding. Can can I get another card to keep going? No, no, no. Once you reach the end, that's it. Wow, that's amazing. I can't. <laughs> There's eight <laughs> red cubes in there. You pulled one out. There was still seven. Wow. <laughs> All right, what's your score? I don't know. Uh, three, six. Seven, eight, oh my. nine, ten. Wow. And then how do I do this one? During the score and knowledge step. You don't have a purple book out there. Oh, I have to pull a purple. Um, during each. All books of that color. Yeah, you're right. Yeah. Okay, so what was it again? Three, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Wow. Fourteen and twelve is. Um, I'll do math. Twenty-six. <laughs> I do math all day long at work. Like I literally to score. You don't know. Yeah, I literally have to write numbers on every box that I put up. Every single box. I don't like that I have more points because I don't get to choose first. Um. So yeah, if you want to check the game out, head over to that link. I believe it's twenty five dollars for this game. You get a whole bunch of stuff. It's it, everything you see here is what you get. Um, there is also an expansion, and I don't know exactly what it adds to it, but depending on how much fun we have with this, I may just pick it up. Okay. We'll just see. I don't. I don't know. This didn't come with it. I don't think. Come with I'm not what? Sure. 
the mini expansion. I think so. There's a mini expansion. Um, I feel like it did. I don't I feel know. Like I saw something somewhere. I don't know, but th- right now this is the base game as far as I know. Yeah. Can I see the rule book real quick? Yes. Like you're drawing and choosing. Yes. Um. Oh, wait, that was the end of the round. So another, uh, another book burns. Uh oh. The one with the lowest number. So that's the yellow. Yeah. It doesn't matter where they go. Can I just put them together? I mean, I don't want them together. Like, try to put them in the same order that they are because then you can just turn them over. No, I mean, like, right next to it. Yeah, I can't do that that way. Well, I was going to say, you could do it right next to the off screen. Just keep it in the same order. I mean, if it has the symbols on it, I, I can symbol. I mean, okay, just it's easier that way than you can just flip them over and the game is ready again. Okay. Um, it's the show on Netflix that I told you about that I want to watch. I know. I know. Um, what was that thing I was looking at? So, yeah, I'm last again, so I get to choose. First, I, I really need to make up some points. Okay, so there are variants of this game. Oh, there's a whole bunch. There's a whole bunch of stuff in here. I believe there is a solo mode as well. I was going to say, there's a solo mode. Yeah. There's a solo robot variant. Mm hmm. You know what you have? A lone librarian variant. There's a multiplayer with robot. You had really good luck with the second, so I'm going to take the second. All right, it's your choice. You There's choose. A no tools variant for kids. Oh, the wildfire variant was interesting. You uh, you kill two sections every turn. There's an inferno variant. It's yeah. already an inferno. No. Yes. I'm gonna choose this one. So the back of the book has a quick setup guide too, so that's easy to follow. Um, one thing that I appreciate most about um, Weird Draft games is they make these games super easy to play. Not only that, but they make their rule books super easy to follow at the same time. It's what is this from? No, oh, no. Did you not put it in the bag? No, I did not. So now there's nine of them in the bag. I gotta read this card again. Yeah, the rule book, super easy to follow. Um, it tells you what you can do. It tells you the phases, and then it explains each phase. That's how rule book should be. You All know. Right, so with fire spreading, it's if I pull two fire cubes on a on safe spaces, or if I pull a fire cube on one of these, right? Yes. Okay. Yes, it, it takes two on the safe spots and only one on these dangerous spots here okay. with the fire on it uh oh uh oh my card <laughs> slingshot yep oh i hate that card mm, just... all right i already know what i know i already know what it is Take that. Hmm. that's not my card you move it further then <laughs> so you want to explain what that slingshot does I already know what it does. Place one fire token and your most valuable book, which was only one that I had, yep. on another player's turn order card to continue saving books. If you are the last player, these tokens are set aside until the end of the round. Yeah, so this game has a little bit of take that in it. Um, I'm already... I'm already set for my next turn here. Thankfully, I have the water bucket I'm stopping now Woo boy wow you have the Four, best luck five, six, seven, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15 15 in total mm -hmm. e well, with bravery reason. and knowledge yeah and, and that okay 15 oh boy um I'm never seven, gonna choose a card first and <laughs> 
I mean, that's your fault. <laughs> that's totally your fault. This keeps showing on my shoulder every time I move. What? The damn mic. Oh, okay. I'm like, what is that on my arm? <laughs> All right, give me the cubes. Mm -mm. Put them in there. Mm -mm. I have a feeling I'm going to end up using my bucket. Your, your butt? My bucket. Um, oh boy. I'm already starting with a red one. Yeah, draw another one. <laughs> uh, draw, place a drawn fire token on this card till the end of your turn. This does not trigger fire spreading. You can use it at any point, though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I just, I, I really... You have to start a fire first. Yeah, I don't want to have to do that. I do. I want to do it Oh, that's so bad. A lot of bad things happen. Burn. Red. No. Oh. -ho. Don't like this. Uh. Push it. I kind of have, have to. I kind of have to. You have to. a bucket. Just keep going. I am way behind in points. I know. I have no points. Um, you seem to be able to pull these cubes out and not even worry about <laughs> burning these books. Yeah, because this game doesn't have the mistress mummy in it. I can play this uh, game. Yeah. She keeps coming after me with rocks and snakes. Uh, oh, boy. Oh. Red. Red. No! Oh. Stop it. Holy. Wow. You should push it again. Wow. <laughs> you should keep going. Oh, no. Oh, yes. No, 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 no. I should. I filled up a whole car. Why can't you? I should do it. No, there's no limit on how many tools you have, by the way. I know. I'm just saying. I filled up a full car. You can do it, too. Oh, man. <laughs> what do you, get? you guys think I should keep going? I'm smack talking. Do it. Should I keep going? Go. You, you guys decide for me because I can't do it. Pull it. Somebody either say <laughs> yes or no. I'll take the yes. first answer. Because this is going to be... On you. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Ultimately, it's going to be on me. Give me yes or no. I'm going to give you guys the... Uh... 20 seconds or so. Okay, there we go. Time roller got it. Push it. Okay. Wow, it's going to be red. It's got to be red at this point. <sighs> There's so many red cubes. There's so many in there. That's going to be white. <laughs> it's going to be white. <laughs> Dang, I don't know my colors today. Are you crazy? Stop, Rand says. I made it only to the end. I didn't even have to use these. Your two pairs, the four pair. I guess that was part of. Oh. What? You gotta send me the actual link so I can watch it because I'm never gonna find it here. Panic's played this game before. before yeah, people. he's he's mentioned it. Mm -hmm. Um, I think this game would be really cool to play with four players. Of course, it'd probably be quicker. People would be burning up the whole library. <laughs> wow. Okay. I guess you're stopping. No, I have to. But... It's full. All right, so I'm gonna stop. And I'm gonna score. Um, so that's war books are three points each. So three, six, nine. Tell them. And these are worth two. So that's ten, eleven so plus 16. six is uh, seventeen. Yeah. So I go from um, eighteen to thirty-seven. I'm taking a lot. Right? Did I say it was 16 points? Or... Uh, 369, 10. Did I say it was 16? I'm trying to figure it out. 369, 10. 10, 11. Yeah, 16. Yeah. So uh, that's 30, uh, 34. 16 and 18 is 34. There you go. All right. Um, I'm going to use my map. Oh, this is stupid. My map says score your bravery points from this round again. So that's an extra six. Get off mine. So 34 and six is 40. Get away from my spot. You're still ahead. I don't want to get I'm not far enough ahead. Um, and then draw a card from the tool deck. Yeah, it's from the tool deck. That one stays up. Oh, really? Yep. 
Oh, so uh, this is random. When I, uh, thank you. When I um, was watching the thing. Shovel. Twice this turn, you may draw two tokens and add one to your turn order card. The one you don't keep is a book. Put it back in the library bag. If it is a fire token, leave it on the shovel until the end of your turn. You it twice in a turn. That's cool. That's pretty cool. Put all those good cubes back in here. Okay. All the cubes going back. All right. Now i got to burn. Yeah. So this is the end of the round. We're going to burn the card with the lowest, it's and that's scary. that one. More fire. Ah! More fire added. So this is progressing um, the game pretty quickly. I need this room to burn. What, what is the that purple? One burn? Yes. No one has no one has started a fire yet. Amazingly, we're doing too good to be no, like true that. right now. Um. So when this is the lowest number, this is what's gonna. Gosh, that's gonna take forever. Yeah. So well, maybe not with that. So we haven't seen what happens when you start a fire, but all the books that you currently have saved catch fire, which means that yeah. the cards corresponding to those books will catch fire yeah. and go away. And then your books and your actual saving yeah. stock keep. Them. Yeah. You're still behind. Choose a theme. Card. I shall choose. You know what? I had very good uh, luck with the two. I'm taking my card. I'm going to take second again. Now it is your choice. Get my third. First again? Mm -hmm. Very well. So there's 10 cubes in the bag now? There's so many. There's so many cubes in the bag. <laughs> you have any tools besides that uh, collector's nope. edition? Oh, this is a great start. Oh, fire already. Uh oh. Oh, I get to start a fire. Oh, okay. So special rule. <laughs> I have no books to burn. You have no books to burn. There is a... Um... There's a rule for that. Yeah, there Aww. is actually. I'm about to draw a cube. Um... Until I pick a book. Um, <laughs> if only fire tokens were drawn, remove the library card with the lowest burn index number. That's basically it. So that's going to be um, the yellow one, yeah. Uh, yeah. Here's another cube for you. Yeah, for I every fire icon time. revealed on the library section, add one of the unused fire tokens to the library bag. Oh, it's getting worse. <laughs> I started a small fire tonight. <laughs> you did. Oh, man. So you scored nothing on that one. Nope. Okay. I want to go first. Wow. <laughs> okay. Here we go. <clears throat> Here we go. I think uh, luck is going to be changing. I want to get things on fire. <gasps> no, that's the cube I needed. That's a purple one. I needed to do that one. I have no cards to help me. You don't have cards. Oh, wait. Do you? You did start a fire. Yeah, uh, I think now. you do get a card. Oh, dang it. Um, I'm gonna use this one. Yeah, return all tokens on their turn order cards to the library bag. Take a tool of your choice from the tool market or draw the top card of the tool deck. I got the gloves. Two cloaks came out? That's horrible. Okay, you got the gloves? Yeah. Nice. Because all spaces on my turn order card are safe spaces. Yeah. All right, there you go. Oh my gosh. Wow. Uh, I really want to use my shovel. I don't know though. In a different uh, conversation, that would be scary. Yeah. Twice this turn, you may draw two tokens. If that one was that, I would have gotten that one. And add one to your turn order card. The one you don't keep is a book. I'm going to try that out. I'm going to use it. Might as well. What is July 25th? July 25th? I don't know. All right. So I'm going to draw two. And then choose one. Oh. Wow. 
It's just one we've got to go to registration for a hunter. Oh. Um. Ooh, man, if it is a fire token, leave it on the shovel until the end of the turn. I'm going to do it again. So I get to do this twice. It says you may do it twice. So you don't have to. But I'm going to. I've got two purple books. Two fables. Oh, cool. Which one's worth more? They're both worth the same. They're both worth the same? Okay. Well, I'll go ahead and just take the um, geo geography book. No black history for you? Uh, That's what no, no history for me. I know a lot about history already. God, my ankle hurts so bad. I need, like, a thing under the table. Okay, so... Can you hit me with a small piece of paper from the What? What are you talking about? I don't know what... My foot? Um, I think I'm going to stop. I'm going to go ahead and stop. I think I've made a, a lot of points so far. That's good. Yeah, so I'm going to stop. So I'm going to go ahead and score. Um, I've got four... Eight. Eight. Twelve. Twelve. Fifteen. Fifteen points plus. 20. No, fifteen and four is nineteen. Oh. Yeah. I mean, I could I take twenty wrong. points. Four, eight. What? Twelve. Thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen. Oh, nineteen. Never mind. Yeah. Yeah, it's nineteen. I found it twenty for some reason. Oh. Well, um,. So I'm at 59 points. Mm -hmm. uh, that I believe is not with the. Um, yes, it was. That was with it. Yes, yeah. that was with the bravery points. And that is. Make sure you take your fire off and get rid of your shovel. Yeah. So fire's gone. Shovel is used. These go back in the bag. Now we burn another section of the library because that is the end of the round. That's this one. Yeah, the lowest number. This is the first one we've got one of the lowest. Oh, ones. another cube of fire. Oh, I get to go first. No. I got the lowest points. Yeah, you do. Oh. You're going to take number two? No, I'm going to take number one. Oh. You should move it over a little bit. You can't see. I know. There you go. Wim. Wim. Oh. I know I haven't done it yet, Wim. I'm sorry. What? I haven't measured my wrist yet. Oh. I was busy this weekend, and I hurt my ankle. I need a measuring tape. I don't know where it is. I think I'm going to take it easy this time. You want to take three? I'm going to take it easy. Since you have those gloves, I know you're going to use those. I might. So I'm going to take it easy and take third. This is my only tool. Oh, breakfast. Perfect. Read the book. Yep. So far, she's already started one fire. Okay. Um, as you can see, the library is starting to... I'm using it. <laughs> ...in flame. Um, if you're using it, go ahead and do this, like, right here next to it, just so that we know it, you're using it to yeah, remind so us. Yeah, so all these are safe. Yeah. So all your spots on your... Uh-oh. ...on your board are safe. This is not good. Unless I catch things on fire. Ooh, okay. Okay, are you going to keep going? Yes. I'm not going to waste this card. Oh, wow. Are you going to keep going? <laughs> yes. Uh-oh. Oh, no. You don't have anything to help. No. All right, so that's two. So what happens, though? Well, here's what happens. Okay. I have to burn one of the books, right? No, or all, of, all of your books. All of your books. So... The yellow book will burn, so one of the all spaces are safe. Okay. Yes, but you but drew, drew two that. of the fire cubes. They don't have to be beside each other or anything. It's just no, two no, now. just two, just two. Ah. Um. So the yellow, the war books burn, so that's gonna that's go away. Yep. Yeah. And that's that top card. Oh, no fire gets added. Okay, and then um one of the this history one. books gets burned. Ah, I don't like this not burning part. Um, and then you get no points. And I get a card. And you do get a tool. <laughs> you do get to pick a tool. That did not help me. Mm. 
Wow. Pop deck in it. <laughs> I'm gonna do it again. <laughs> I'm gonna catch Shimmer Fire. What? No more gloves. <laughs> Did we shuffle I had, that? I had two gloves, apparently, not just one. Did yes. We, how I good did, did we shuffle that? Because we have two cloaks out there. They didn't come out at the same time. Okay. I'm just saying. <laughs> I had two gloves. Why yeah. would they not come in a pair? I don't know. All right. Oh, man. I'm a little worried. You There's a whole lot of fire in that bag. <laughs> yeah. That, that, that went quick, though. Like, you just caught everything on fire. I tried to put it out with my foot and it just spread. Yeah, you're just... <laughs> <laughs> so I think it should be a thing that if you start a fire, you should tell a story on how you started the fire. My foot had gasoline and I just like shook it and it just went everywhere. Your foot had gasoline on it, <laughs> so you right shook now. it. <laughs> to make the fire spread. And caught your books on fire while you were holding them. Mm -hmm. Were you holding them with your foot? <laughs> I have talented people. Oh Stop boy. drawing my purple cubes. Oh boy. That's what I keep pushing for is a purple cube. I keep taking them. Well, you know, as long as you keep starting fires and I keep not getting fires, then we're, we're okay. You know what's going to happen. I have one safe spot left on what my about card. Your bucket? How's your bucket doing? My bucket is fine. Oh man. I could use another tool for sure. I think I'm a little bit ahead. Um, oh, man. So that's five points per. I tell people come in and tell me to save the books when I start catching things on fire. Yeah. I think I'm going to stop. Mm. I'm going to stop. Um, I've got some points here. Five, ten. Five, ten. Fourteen. Fourteen points for me. Um, so... Set in the library ablaze. We should get fired for that. <laughs> right? I did say it was a good library. All right. So since I stopped on a tool spot, I will go ahead and get myself a tool. Choose one of your books to save and score for its knowledge points. Um, choose one book that you've saved. Place it on the lockbox. Score it again at the end of the game. Yep. That could be useful. But I'm kind of curious on what's behind this card here I guess we'll see it any either way I'm gonna try this one another bucket oh I could have used another bucket Fire. all right so that is the end of another round mm. so these rounds are going faster and faster if you can't tell <laughs> lowest number okay so in the there's more fire uh, the the lower you go in these cards, in the stack. Um, I like how it just changes the picture. I like how the that one space is just nice and safe. Yeah, it's cool. Hey, put your card back. Uh, yes. Because I need to choose. You do. You, you choo -choo choose. Choose wisely. Mm. So you, you have to have that little balance of going for points and going for tools. Unless you just want to catch everything on fire and you tool that That's way. That's what I did last turn. Yeah. Um, we didn't reveal any cards that have a fire token no. on them, so we're still good with the ones we have in the bag. Um, right? Fire! Who are you choosing? Oh, man. I, I'm way ahead right now. Yeah, you can go first and catch things on fire. I am way ahead. You know I did that? I don't want to do that. <laughs> You have buckets. I do, but I want all the buckets. No. Nope. I, I think I'm going to stay safe with third. No. Stay safe. You go first. Try not to uh, start another fire. You are using your gloves yet again. So all of your spaces are safe spaces. Oh, God. It's already going great. Already? Yep. All right. You Hold on. Nope. Wow. <laughs> My gloves caught on fire again. Okay? Your gloves caught on fire. <laughs> it caught on fire from the other one. Okay, so your other foot had gasoline on it now? No, my, my gloves that was were on fire. So you tried to wipe your foot off with your gloves and that got yeah. the gasoline on it? And... It's gone. Okay. So you know what happens. The lowest number is going uh, to... 
Oh gosh, another fire cube is going to be added. Wait, just one. No, just one. Wait, I had... I had two fires, though. It doesn't matter. He's just the no. one. No. Oh. Just the one. I wanted to give you more fire in the bag. I do get another fire. Did you already put it in there? Yeah. Okay. Oh, boy. It says that cat poop lasers. Oh. Mochi. It does now. <laughs> All right, here we go. Here we go. Oh, there's so many tokens in here. I know my luck's gonna run out eventually. There you go. Yeah, you catch things on fire now. Yeah. Yeah. Well, there we go. Back at you. I do have a bucket still, so let's just hope for the best for this bucket. No. Okay. Nope. Doing good still. That's worth five points. Not bad. I could technically stop now and be okay, but I do have a bucket. Um, and with your luck, I think I'm okay. Finally, he draws a fire. I know. Right? He talked about this fire bag for half the stream, yeah. and he finally draws fire. That is one hot bag. <laughs> All right. Oh, oh man. I, uh, you should push it. You have a bucket. I should push it. I want another bucket, though. If I have two buckets. See? And even thought you were cheating. <laughs> I don't do you that. You were looking in a bag. How? My hand. No. Nope. My hand fits the Everybody whole bag. Everybody could see me. I was doing like this. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. All right. All right. Let's just go one more. Let's go one more. Oh. I see fire inside the mountain. No, no. Not my mountains. Fire. Oh, use my bucket. <laughs> <laughs> I'm stopping. I'm done. <laughs> oh boy. Uh. Yeah, I'm done. I am done. Please. So let's score uh five points for the the war book Good and nine, four points for the fables. So that's nine points. Um. 82 and they go back in the bag oh. was that the end of the round yep okay so <clears throat> this one catches that fire. one's gonna catch fire okay i think i think we're getting down to the last few cards on some of these stacks i don't know it's hard to tell you're not supposed to tell I'll never tell. And I do get a um, tool. Was I supposed to get a tool? I caught things on fire. You did. You go ahead and choose your tool. I keep forgetting. Slingshot? Not cool. I'll take the bucket. Oh, do you... Hold on. Do you remember what cube I had? Because I could put a cube on here. Choose one book that you saved, place you it on... You had yellow, and you had purple. I had a purple? I'm going right? to keep the purple token on there. Hello, Cosima. Cosima, what's up? So All a right. knapsack came out. After scoring, place one book you have saved to the knapsack. Draw a token. If draw a book, score for both books. If you draw a fire, the book in the knapsack burns, <gasps> and you don't get to draw a tool. Oh, Purple. Alright, my turn. Yep, I am keeping the purple in my lockbox. So I'm gonna get to score this at the end of the game. Um okay. Now I do have a bucket. I'm wondering if I should risk it. But there are more tokens in there. Mm -hmm. What do you guys think? First or third? I don't think it's third. I'll take the first eye. I'll take the first answer that I see. First or third? I'm going to sip my coffee while I wait. You guys are choosing my fate right now and the fate of this library. No, it looks unfairable. Mm hmm. Choose wisely. First, Time Roller says, got it. 
Why you do this to me? <laughs> Why? Because you get to draw. Why you no, do that? You catch things on fire. Why? Oh boy, there's a um, a really cool metal cover of Icy Fire. Oh. I am so glad that we kept the uh, links open to everybody. We get some cool stuff. Yeah. Like I said, guys, um, if you want to check this game out, um, there's a link that Mubot should be thrown up there. Thank you. All you need is love for sure. You don't get enough of that. Or you get too much and you catch the library on fire. <sighs> See what I said? Fire. Ooh, boy. That's hot. That's hot. <laughs> <laughs> I, I put my hand in an ember and I was like... <gasps> you tried to save my foot. I tried to save your foot. <laughs> and then, then I remembered it's just a foot. Oh, yeah. There's no knowledge in that foot whatsoever. No. So let's I let's hope I don't need to use the bucket. And I don't. Oh. Uh, one more again. Stop drawing the purple ones. They're supposed to be for me. Mm -hmm. One more again. Well, you're not going to be able to use your slingshot until next round, maybe. No. Because I'm already going, and you're not going to be able to put any more bullets oh, or fires true. on me. Here we go. I may have to use this bucket. I may not. If it is not a fire, then I'll probably end up stopping. Unless somebody says to keep going. Oh, oh boy. Oh, you're going to keep going. Oh, man. That is so tempting. It is so tempting. Do you more copies? I think this is the most fun I've had playing a push your luck game. What about the mischief game? The what game? You know what I'm talking about. I have no idea. Yeah. Oh, the uh, the temple. Yeah, I don't know. The, I mean, man, this is this is stressful and fun at the same time. I don't know if I should keep going or not. I feel like I should. But I am way ahead. There's there's a good gap in score right here. Should I keep going? Right now, I'm scoring five points for the history book and five points for the fables. That's ten points. And I get to save a bucket. So right now, 14 points. Oh, and says stop. Okay, cool. <laughs> Thank you so much. <laughs> I was having some real anxiety there, deciding whether to keep going or not. All right, I'm stopping. Yep. Uh, 14 points. Because, um... Yep. 10 and 4 is 14. Yep, 10 and 4. So, 82 plus 14 is, uh, 96. What happens if you keep going? I don't know. We need to get some more fires. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Whew. Okay. Put your yeah. card back. Huh? Yes, I should put my card back. Thank you, Anne, for telling me to stop. <laughs> <laughs> it is really fun. I'm having a lot of fun with this one. I am so glad that we picked this up. Um, you guys know I don't really do well in push your luck games, but this one is just, I'm just on fire on this one. No pun. No pun. I'm stopping. You're stopping? Mm-hmm. Okay. That was quick, though. Um, game ends immediately when any destroyed library card, which is where 10 is revealed, yeah, um, you'll points. know when it comes out. I got 12 points. 12 points? Yep. Yeah. Okay, so that's uh, 41 and 12 is uh, 50. 50. What? 41 and 12 is 53. What? 41 and 12? Oh, I thought you said 40. 53. Right. I didn't pull any purple, which okay. I wanted to, but. All right. <clears throat> All right, so that is the end of another round. We're going to burn another part of the library. Which is the lowest one? That one? 11. Oh boy. Another fire token. It's added. And you do get to choose first. 
Do you get to choose first? Right. You said twenty-five dollars, I believe, on the website. Um, if Mubot would really throw that. Buffett says, by the way, did anybody hear the new Carcassonne game that's co-op? It will be featured in my next blog post. What? Carcassonne no. co-op. I like Carcassonne. That was one of the first yeah, games you, I played. You don't like co-op games. I don't. <laughs> I like Carcassonne though. Um, you know what? I'm I'm gonna stay safe. You like to burn things with your foot. I'm good. Well, if my foot wasn't injured, I wouldn't. Uh-oh. Uh, yeah. See? See? <laughs> there you go. How much are these white books worth? Okay. Um, there's six points. Now. I know. I'm stopping. You do have a slingshot, by nope, the way. No, I'm stopping. Okay, I'm just letting you know. So six, twelve. What oh. are black bark books worth? Uh, history books are worth five points. Okay, so twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one. Twenty-one points. Twenty-one. Wow. Um, seventy-four. 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 Seventy-four.
Um, draw a token. If you draw a book, score for both books. Draw fire, then the... Oh. Oh, boy. What's that amulet do? Draw one token from a library back for every turn card that has yeah, been no, chosen yet. No! Yeah. <laughs> no! Oh, look at that. Got that book. The book and the knapsack burns, but do not take a tool. So I don't know if I was able to use that well, I when I got it. it in the wrong place? It was after scoring. Is it? Yeah. Okay, yeah. The amulet says draw one token from a library bag for every turn order card that hasn't been chosen yet. Select the token to place on each unchosen turn order card in the leftmost there space. There goes my backpack. Goodbye, backpack. You were good for one turn. It's not specifically Halloween themed, but the theme with the ghost fits pretty well. Yeah. I mean, I like spooky stuff, so you, you guys that's know, gonna get me. You guys know our um, history with ghosts and stuff. Put that card back. We gotta keep stuff on fire now. So, let's go ahead and catch the uh, library on fire. Yep. Put another fire cube in. Oh. Okay. There we go. I'm gonna shake it up real quick. Um, you're. I guess I get to choose first. Yeah, you still get to choose first. Mm. Mm. Now, you do remember you have your slingshot, okay? I do. I do not have any more tools. Nope, you just have a box. I have a, I have a lock box. It's not gonna help me. But you know what? Let's 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 go with first. Let's do it. Catch things ablaze. Give me more points. Catch a blaze. Well, I went first because I'm allowing you not to use your slingshot on me. I need this room to go away for this one to be lower, so the the purple cube will be worth more. <laughs> right. All right. All right. All right. All right. All right. Here we go. Fire. Here we go. It's fire. Is it? Is it? Yeah. Oh man. It is. It's fire. Yeah, it's fire. It's so bad right now. Um, it's it's gonna be black. It's very thematic <laughs> how the the more the library burns, the more fire cubes you put in the bag. It's so good. That's how fire works. Yeah, but in a game, it's it's super thematic, and I just if this one's it black, feels it. you feel the pressure. Dot. Would you stop rushing? Is it black? <laughs> <laughs> no, it's Aww. not. So we're at two points. Um, <laughs> <laughs> oh, I really don't think I should. That was even lucky right there. I want to hold on to my spot. You're only going to get eight points. Yeah, well, that's eight points and not zero points. You should do it. Again. I'm going to stop. <laughs> I, you know what? I'm not going to listen to you. <laughs> I'm going to stop and get my eight points. So, um, there we go. All right. These all go back in here. I did not call to fire or anything. Um, have at it. Have fun. Uh, keep your feet away from the books. No. My Please. Foot hurts. These, this library is super important. Nope. It is the library of all human knowledge. That's a, that's what the story says of this game. So you're really toying with human knowledge by putting gasoline on your foot and shaking it off. Wow. I wanna be fair. What says you? Oh no! <laughs> you burnt so many books. I, what? You burnt so many books. Mm. That's a that's a dangerous spot right there. Yeah, and I can't do anything with mm. my slingshot because you don't have a card, right? If you have on another player's, yeah, yeah, do I don't have, have a turn card. card. Did Misty give you a hot foot? What? No. <laughs> no. Bye, Phantom. All right, do I start? Love you too. Have you a good start day. Here burning. Yes, burn the book. Fire. Oh, cube. Another fire cube. 
And then this one. That's uh, okay. Oh boy. And then we're gonna this one. Oh boy. Wow, that fire is raging out of control right now. It's only the top layer. They can stay Just with the rest. The top layer. That's amazing. They put so much. Just awesome time into this to make it look so great. Even though it's burning and it's a horrible thing to see. All of those books just... It's horrible for my PTSD. Turning to ash. Nobody thought about that part. <laughs> Alright. Thank you, Wim. Alright, so all these go away, right? Because I burned everything. Yes. And I get a card. You do... <gasps> Almost lost the cube. You do. You get a card. Mm. You can top deck it, or yeah, you can I'm grab a cloak. I'm not crazy about that amulet. Yeah. Oh, a box. You got a box. Now we burn another part of the library. I like this part. This is the end of the round. <laughs> oh, and the last cube gets put in. Okay, here, here it goes. This is it. This is this is gonna start to get really hairy now. All right, so you're you're way behind here. Oh, I should have stopped when I was there. Yeah. Okay. So so many fire cubes in here. Uh, but. So for my slingshot, I technically have to draw a fire and a book to use it. Just one fire token and your most valuable book. No. No? No. But I can't draw two fire. I would have to draw a book and a fire. So, so I think this is used when, um, when, you drew, when you've drawn your second fire cube. Okay. So that prevents a fire from starting. So you basically kick one of those books at my face. Oh, I like this part. That's like on fire. My foot book. Your foot book. You, you literally oh. kick it to me. Hey, choose card. Uh, I choose card now. I choose second. So you go first. Um, I'm hoping the slingshot does not come into play. Because there's so much fire. I want to do this one that was six months. Okay. Oh boy. Okay, that's a lot. Oh wow. <clears throat> What'd you draw? I'm stopping. Wow. Ah. You have your slingshot. Now it's only going to be a fire cube and one of your your most valuable books. Wow! All right. Wow! <laughs> wow! That was All lucky. Right, that's six points. That's seven. Okay, so seven, fourteen. Twenty-eight. What? Twenty-eight. Oh, uh, just 28. in yellow. Just in yellow. And then twenty-eight, thirty-nine, thirty-two, thirty-one, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four. 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41. 41 plus 8 for bravery. That's, that's with oh, that. Oh, that's with that? 48, yep. So 41? 48. You said 41. Did I? Yeah. Oh, 41 then. I said 8 because I'm looking at the 8. <laughs> yeah, 41. Wow. So right now you're at 74. So we'll go by 10 so really quick. 10, 20, yeah. 30, 40. So you were at 70, so 10. I was there. 20. Yeah. 30, 40, 40, then 8, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, no, 7, 8. Oh. <laughs> I want 48. You, you keep going to 40. <laughs> oh, you you went way past me there. All right, I'm going to save one of these cubes. Oh, man. Yeah, suck it. Sorry for the math. Really bad math that we're doing. Wow. Here. You go now. Wow. That was a really good turn. <laughs> you 
You managed to dodge all of that fire. I was like, doot, 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 doot. All that fire. All of those 17 fire cubes in that bag. We'll all of them in here. There's 17 because there's seven to start with. And then there's 10 on the table. There's 17 in there. And I managed to avoid all you of them. You did manage to avoid all of them. They didn't even have to use my sling shot. No. Pew, pew. Which means that it's going to be you know what? bad luck for me. Trooper. You're a pretty good stormtrooper. Oh, jeez. Oh, look at this. <laughs> I'm, all, I'm just gonna grab all reds. That's I all like it that is. Part. Unless I decide to stop, which is not gonna win me the game. Oh, uh, what is seven, seven points? points. Right plus, you get a tool. Uh, plus, I get a tool. Okay. <laughs> yeah. The camera looks like, oh, look, let's see some fire. Misty has a magic hand. <laughs> <laughs> let it burn. No, time roller. Let it burn. Let it burn. Oh, I c you know, coming from you, you played a game where you burned a whole forest down, so <gasps> I yeah. Tiny. I can see that coming from you. He's no Rex. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Alright, I'm gonna stop. This, this is just too much. After we, we play this game though, we need to show everybody what time we got it. Yeah, well we got some stuff. Since Panic's gonna stream his, we should have done that. Yeah. <laughs> Alright. All right, yellow um war book is seven points. And that's all I'm going to get. Tammy says, I'll leave the pills around my Kindle anyways. No. Okay, so I am I'm not ahead by a lot. Mm, you're still ahead. I do get a tool. Right. Draw one token from the library bag. For every turn order card that hasn't been chosen yet, select a token to place on each. Wait, what? <clears throat> you're going to play it at the beginning of the turn before anybody draws cards. Okay. And then you're gonna draw two tokens because there's gonna be. Oh, okay. Two, so there's gonna, gonna be. Put them there's gonna there. be tokens already put on there. Yeah. Okay, I don't like that. I don't like that at all. Let's let's check out what we got okay. here. Yeah. Nope. Shovel. shovel! Oh, I haven't my... gotten a shovel yet. That's my favorite. Get your card back, please. It's my favorite. All right, let's yeah. burn this library down. No. Um. Lowest one is going to be that 17, so that, uh -oh. yeah, history book. Well, we know there's no more fire. <laughs> yeah, there's no more fire to be added, but it's just getting progressively worse. I'm going to go second. Um, all right, so since I got the shovel, I feel like going first is okay. Fire tower is... Need a forest fire to take out your rivals. Yeah, so an, a use of fire to take out your opponents in that game. It's like, what did nature do to you? <laughs> That's horrible. Like that theme for me is an automatic no. No. Even if it's just a game. Like there, there's out no. Out of all the terrible games we played. No, it's just the theme of it. It's just you're burning a fire, a forest. Just to from this point to Matthew, your... you should be removing all those colored books from the bag. Probably. Um, yeah, because they're worth more points. Yeah, yeah. I'm glad I glad I saved the purple for the end. It would be great if I could, you know, get some purple so I can double all score right. them. I haven't been able to score that card since the first time I got it. All right, come it. on. Come on. Don't give me a red. Don't give me a red. No. There's, there's all the books in there. All of the you books. Do you use a shovel? I, I will after this first one. Okay, it's going to be fire. Hmm. <laughs> Man. The next okay. One will be white and black. I'm um, using shovel. It's going to be white and black. Draw two tokens. Add one to your turn order card. I like guessing. This is my favorite part. It's going to be white and black. Okay, here we go. If it's both red, then I just did burn everything. Bleh. Everything's burnt. Oh, I already saw. Oh, my God. <laughs> Look what you did, you asshole. <laughs> you burned them all. Oh, why? Where are the books? You caught them on fire. That's why they're not there. Oh, no. 
Oh, that looks like that's that is Sam. horrible. That's my first time, I think, right? Oh, let's take that shovel away, dear. <laughs> that was horrible. I know. It feels bad, doesn't it? I've done it twice. <laughs> All right, well, poor old Lord let's go ahead and uh, burn uh, number 18. Oh, this boy. Oh, God, it just got so bad. Oh, that's so bad. <laughs> All right, that these was are... still the pretty spot. All right, they're all going Why'd back you do in. That? Um, I do get a, a tool because I set fire. Oh, man. Come on, give me something good. Collector's edition. Plays a book, so he's a little too late. I mean No, there's yeah. 17 fire tokens in the bag. I'll be lucky <laughs> to use that. Yeah. Now. Mm, yeah. There you go. Here, have fun drawing all the yellows and purples. Ooh. 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 Here we go. More fire. More fire. <laughs> wow. Uh, which one's what was this one? Oh. And you do get oh. We're at the bottom of this one. Yeah, I think that's it. Um, Are you sure? Pull me to the bottom of it. It says the game ends immediately when any destroyed library card, which are worth 10, is revealed. Oh, well, I didn't need the game. Yeah, the building has collapsed and all books remaining within are lost. <sighs> yeah. I don't know how to score those 10. I think maybe if you saved that yeah, book, they would that's score what that. You get. Yeah. But. I get seven more points. All right, so let's go through. Uh, and you get seven more points. It's easy. Just add seven to both of them. Is that it? Yes. I think that is it. It doesn't even have a um, scoring section on here. At least I don't because think you it score does. when you score. Yeah. Yeah, you pretty much just score it. Yep. Okay. So give us both seven points. All right, so let's start with you first. So you're going to get seven. One. Seven. Yep, you get seven. And I'm going to get seven. Yep. You have two in front of me. Or one in front of me. Two. Two, yeah. Um, that's the end. And that's it? Yep. <gasps> There's no more scoring. Wow, that was close. I wish I would have kept white now instead of stupid purple. I mean yellow. Well, you know, geography books. No one, no one really keeps them. So the micro expansion uh, is called te technology books micro expansion. Yeah. I don't think we have that one. Why would it be in the full book if we don't have it? Because it's already been made. It's just. They would put it in the rule book if we didn't have it. Maybe I don't know. I think that's dumb. I think you're wrong. I I may be wrong. Let me see what's in the box. I might be wrong. Well, look, you get the best library card. The best librarian card. You gotta take a picture on Best librarian, media. guys. I didn't use my foot. Yeah. It's got a Twitter and a Facebook. Okay, so. put it on the scoreboard. Scoreboard. Alright, so there is solo reference cards. There's references for pretty much all the... Oh, we do have the micro expansion. I told you we did. Why would they literally put it in the box? All right, sorry, I didn't think we did. No, I knew we did. Oh wait, no, no, this is library cart and axe. This isn't micro expansion. No. Well, These are the cards you took out for the two player. Yeah. So we don't have it. I don't. Which is fine. Um, it's it's. I just don't understand the purpose of it being in the rule. Because sometimes they there. make it. No. Sometimes they just make it. No. That's why I don't see anything don't else like in it. here. But, but there you go. I need another copy. Best librarian ever. No. I got it does come it with this Instagram. neat little postcard though, that you can see the. Oh wait, it does have a fire up there already. See that? It's already started. But it's a cool little postcard. And it's got Weird Draft Games old logo on it, if you can see that. It's super weird. But it's cute. 
So there you go. That is Fire in the Library, the push your luck, save all the books game. You didn't save nothing. I didn't say <laughs> <laughs> But I'm the best librarian, though. How would you say that? Where's the puke icon? I saved more books than you did. But two more, <laughs> two more books. Yeah, if you want to check that out, head over to uh, Weird Giraffe Games' uh, website. I believe it's on there for twenty five dollars right now. They, um, I think it was twenty nine. Um, and if you want to check out the micro expansion, check that out too. Yeah, because I want to see what that. Because I want, yeah, I do want to see what that does too. Um, but I had fun. This is a great game. Um, I knew it was going to be something that you were going to like just based on what I saw at the um, Origins convention. Um, so I had to get it. Super awesome game. Weird Giraffe does it again. I like it. Yeah, and the cards on here are so good. What does it look like at the end? At the end? This is what it looks like at the end. Let's put them all together. I can stop messing them up. Sorry. Here you go. There you go. You put it all together, and there's your library. Just Aww, a, not just a sad, sad. City. Yeah. There you go. But that is cool. I like how the art on the cards change as the fire gets more intense. That is super awesome. And you get your scoreboard right on the game box itself. That's what we've been doing. I wasn't happy with that part. You weren't happy with that? No. I can see why. It does take up a lot of space. It does. And it doesn't lay completely flat. But, I mean, it's one less thing to pull out of the box. Yeah, so. one of the videos I watched to learn the game, they had like the prototype and the scoring thing was actually a large card and was not inside the box. So I mean, interesting. I mean, if you really wanted to, you can print one out and use that. I mean, it's a little extra step, but yeah. I don't mind it so much. I think it's pretty cool. Um yeah, this is a really good game. I really like it. And you guys know I don't like push your luck games yes, all that do. much. You like eating bread. No, not that much. Yes, you do. No. You like that it. game is anxiety just stricken. I, I posted the anxiety yeah. stricken. This one is too. This one's worse. And I'd rather get bit by a spider and a snake and a mummy <laughs> than the library catching on fire. Um, so what do you want to do? Do you want to... I posted that you want on Instagram with a little pukey icon because you made me feel <laughs> What? <laughs> that is horrible. I... It was a pukey icon and a volcano. Look, I've <laughs> lost the past few games that we've played, haven't I? The one no. game that you're supposed to be good at, and you were good at some of the turns. Um, you filled up your card way more than I did. I know. That's why I should win. But at the end, you know, I, you know. You have two feet. I, yeah. I have my feet still. <laughs> but yeah, so I think we're going to go to our break screen and then come back and we're going to show some more games. Do you want to play something else or do you think we're done? What time is it? 6.30? Yeah. Mm, we can show off what time Lola gave us. Yeah. So we're going to go ahead. And find somebody to read. Yeah, we're going to go to the break screen real quick. We'll be right back. Bleh. Bleh. 